Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to World of Tanks, and this is the face-off. It feels good to be back, ladies and gentlemen, once again, welcome to World of Tanks Face Off. Finally, we are back with Face Off episodes as well. It has been a long time, like almost two months now, if, if not even more. And the reason actually why you haven't seen Face Off episodes on my channel for that long time is simple. Patch 9.15.1 replays were a little bit bad. Because whenever you zoomed in in the first person mode, you're going to zoom in in the free camera mode as well. This was first time seeing that actually, this kind of bug. It didn't happen before with any other patch, so 9.15.1 replays had that problem. And it was actually a really big problem for me, especially for face off series. Just think about it. I'm trying to get epic uh, free camera shots from the distance or close shots, close up shots, and suddenly, boom, zoom in. Super random zoom in into the tank or into the ground or I do not know where. So it was really annoying and uh, thanks to that I wasn't able to record uh, my face of clips that I had for almost two months now, yes. So I was super sad, but how I was able to record those replays anyways. Actually yesterday I thought uh, what if I'm going to use 9.15.1 replays in 9.15 version. Usually, a 9.15 uh, version replays would not work with 9.14, but as it was 9.15.1, not a lot of things changed. It did work, no more zooming issues, and thanks to that I'm able to show you yet another face of episode, guys. So, ladies and gentlemen, in today's face of episode you're going to see USA Heavy Tank Line versus British Heavy Tank Line. From Tier 1 to Tier 10, every single tank. From USA Tech 3, you're actually going to see one of the heavy lines because USA has t 10 e 5 and a T57 heavy tank. But in today's episode, you're going to see t 10 e 5s heavy tank line versus uh, British heavy tank line. But anyways guys, enough chit chat already. Let's get into the action because as you can see, tanks are lined up. Uh, round number one, rules are simple, 8 rounds only and you can shoot only the same tiered target. So tier 1s can shoot tier 1s, uh, tier 2s can shoot tier 2s and so on. Let's see what happened in the first round. And round number one is over. Did you expect to see anything like this, guys? I believe you didn't. The USA actually has two tanks alive. USA has tier 2 alive as well, which was destroyed by medium 1, uh, who didn't quite understand the rules, I believe. Uh, so, still, pretty one sided game. And Matilda and M3 Lee destroyed each other at the same time, so that was interesting. And uh, Conqueror got destroyed by M103 because Conqueror actually bounced one shot. Otherwise, it would be different, I believe. So, first round, one sided, tier 10 was better, tier 8, tier 7, tier 6, tier 5, tier 3, uh, tier 4s were exactly equal, and uh, tier 1 was better as well on the UK side. But uh, let's closer the distance a little bit and let's see what is going to be happening in the second round.
second round is over and I have to tell you guys it is not easy to host event like this. No it is not, because once again someone didn't understand the rules. Churchill 7 killed the D1 heavy tank after he destroyed his opponent. Uh, so that means the USA only has D1 heavy tank alive, but still super one-sided match. Did you expect to see anything like this before you, you started watching today's episode? I believe you didn't. Uh, so this time, once again, uh, FE215B was faster, uh, Conqueror was faster this time, because uh, Conqueror didn't bounce a shot. Uh, tier 8 was better, tier 7 was better, tier 6 was better, uh, but from uh, tier 1 to tier 4, UK tanks won. But now let's have some fun! Tier 1 to tier 10, full YOLO action, best matchmaking EU, NA, let's see what happened. Okay guys, this was something else, complete mayhem. Uh, whenever you see tier 9 vehicle with your tier 7 tank, uh, just think about this matchmaking. This uh, things could be worse guys. <laughs> but uh, once again, super one-sided victory, 10 to 3 victory. British tanks in this kind of situation are godlike. Seems like it, at least, according to the results. Uh, but we have one more round, let's go into the city and let's see what kind of difference it makes.
seems like city-ish map changes things a lot because this time British tanks were able to win 10 to 7. Previous round was 10 to 3 victory. Poor little T110 E5 was Amorect, I guess. Has to be Amorect. But FE 215B is nearly dead, Caravan is nearly dead, and Black Prince uh, with half the HP. So, this was today's face of episode. British tanks won every single round. But, guys, in public games, we know how strong T110 E5 actually is. Over here, DPM fight, British tanks were a lot better. But uh, what do you think about this uh, face-off? What do you think about today's episode? Let me know in the comment section down below. I hope you enjoyed today's episode. I thank you so much for helping me to make this episode. Names are on the screen. Special thanks to you guys. I thank you for watching. Let me know what you would like to see in the next episode. What kind of nation versus nation action you would like to see in my face-off episodes. And I catch you next time. Take care and bye.